Now, after a long pause on the probe of Khalistani terrorist Hardeep Singh Nijjar, Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has stated that uh, they are looking uh, to work constructively with the Indian government to get to the bottom of the matter. The Canadian Prime Minister said that the killing of a Canadian citizen on a Canadian soil is something that they should be taking extremely seriously. He reiterated that the allegations that uh, agents of the Indian government were involved in the killing were credible and added the appropriate investigation is underway. The killings of Khalasani terrorist Nijjar in Canada sparked a diplomatic row between the two countries in the past year after Trudeau alleged that uh, Indian government agents were involved in the killing. Brian, back with us on the broadcast. Uh, Brian, of course, there was a long pause uh, in, in the middle, but now, now again, uh, Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau has spoken about uh, the killing of Hardeep Singh Nijjar. If you could take our viewers through what exactly he has stated. All right, I think we've lost that uh, line over there. Meanwhile, still with us on the broadcast is Colonel J.S.O., the international affairs expert. Sir, um, again, you know, as I was uh, stating earlier, there was a long pause in the middle, but now again, uh, Justin Trudeau has spoken about the probe and he's not really said much about it. You know, if, if you listen to what he said. So what do you want to say on, uh, um, you know, the statements that have been made? Savri, India has time and again clarified that neither it is our intent nor our policy to kill any foreign citizen in any foreign country. And India has always said that we are ready for any fair and transparent probe, provided we are given the evidences which Canada has not done till now. Now, at this critical juncture, uh, when India is poised for the general elections, uh, the Canadian uh, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau making such statements is clearly with a intent to, you know, uh, portray India in a bad light internationally like he has done it early on many occasions. Well, Justin Trudeau should first introspect within. It is their country which has given asylum to many of the dreaded national terrorists because of which uh, today Canada is the next epicenter of the world for terrorism after Pakistan and Afghanistan. I would like to draw the attention of the viewers to a book called uh, 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 Cold Terror, How Canada Nurtures and Exports Terrorism. It is a very good book with good facts and figures, which has clearly uh, said that right from 1980 onwards, when Justin Trudeau's father, Pierre Trudeau, was the Canadian Prime Minister, Canada has become a safe heaven for terrorists. Canada should first set its house in order, give India the requisite evidences. India, as always, will ensure a fair and transparent probe. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.